What's up, man? It's Drewski here for Vivo. And as a DJ, I get so many aspiring artists coming up to me, asking me how can they get their music on the radio? How can they blow up? So today, we got a plan. The surprise of a lifetime. We're going to take an aspiring artist right here in Harlem, New York City. I got my friend DJ Khaled in town. And Khaled is going to give him the keys to success. Man, how are you, bro? Good. Thanks for coming out, Thank hanging out with us. Me, definitely, definitely. We know you're a rapper now, yeah. but I want to take it back to like when you figured out this is what you wanted to be. So I started I started all at age 12. I started off doing poetry, no beats, no nothing like that. At age 13, I had to do a school project. So I took the poetry that I did, I put a beat behind it. When I, I remember vividly a girl walking out of the classroom reciting the chorus that I wrote. At that point in time, I'm like, damn, you know, they, they like it. I probably have a little something. Now going through a lot of hardships, music, I was able to relate to it. And I felt like back in the days, hip hop, you could take something from that, grasp it, and, and move forward with it. I figured I could do that myself, you know what I mean? So I just started, you know, little by little, and uh, at age 16, you know, I stepped on stage in high school. I did a performance in front of like 500 people, man. And the love that I got after that was just bananas. I literally fell in love, you know what I mean? Like, right. I fell in love with it. Tell me some of your accomplishments. Like, what do you feel like has impacted your career? Uh, I've done, um, Three coast to coast, you know, I lost the first two, the third one come in and you know I took a place on that one. These that are one definitely showcase battles. You do one song, you got three, you know, artists in the panel and they all major to to the industry. They just judge you, they critique you and, and first two I completely lost it, you know. What are some of the things you might feel like you're missing to take you to that next level? One major thing that I need is is plug, you know what I mean? Like that one opportunity where I get that chance to be heard. Or well, I feel like, you know, I gotta take constructive criticism and understand that what I'm being told is not to break me down. It's because right. this is really what's needed to be said to make me a better artist. And I feel like when it comes down to that, you know, I gotta listen to what the person is telling me and go about, you know, making my music better, you know what I mean? At what point would you feel like you made it? Like, honestly, I feel like me making it is probably, like, when the world actually knows who Sito is, because at the moment, we don't, you know what I mean? So you've been speaking a lot of real facts, you know, like yeah. a real, lot of real facts. stuff, and we're going to make something happen. Facts, facts, definitely. Ah. Thank you, man. Salute, bro. Always. So I told you, nice. I wanted you to meet one of my friends. Yeah, for sure. And you said you went to constructive criticism. So I don't know if you want to take your glasses off and kiss the ring and bow down to the, <laughs> the go-yard nice. dog, DJ Khaled. What's up, bro? Yo, salute. 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 Salute, man. They tell me that you're you know, a young, new artist. You got to buzz out there. What's going on? Yeah, it's your chance to, to really showcase your talent. Like, what you doing? This is some other man. I said, the product of a lost society. Cause kill for property, what I need. An item could value more than the I could see. A mockery, how they say we all entitled to privacy. Yet it could spare their lives every minute, second. So obviously, authority isn't run by democracy. It's by the streets where shit occurs in places. And at the moment, but rock and see. So evidently, presidents can't prevent it. If they could have, Trayvon would have been here. And so I doubt the generation that follows us will acknowledge us as leaders of a kingdom in which we help be demolished. But a bringing up a future in which we're teaching humanity to rot before our eyes like a cavity without clarity. And not notice that hope's in the hands of the people damaging. A little something, something, you know what I mean? No problem with that. I like to get out with some dope beats. He, he said he felt the only thing missing was constructive criticism and he was open to some cloth talk. Criticism is this. If you ever, like, wake up in the morning and say, yo, why ain't on the radio or my music ain't playing in the club? Because it must not be that powerful. You know what I'm saying? You should answer your own question. But the, the, the main key is, if the music is good, nobody can stop good music. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm living proof of that. You know what I'm saying? They, they wouldn't let me in the game when I first started. I went super hard. It might have took me, you know, 10 years of we the best to get where I'm at now, but I remember coming from the mud, and now, you know, we blessed to see some marble floors. If, you know, you take this advice and, and you really got it, I'm sure I'm gonna hear you on Trusky's show. And maybe I, I might beat them to play it. If you got high, I might come find you, because I'm always looking for new artists. Right, so, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna hook up. You know what I mean? Thank and another key is, man, you know, people gotta get to know your story, know who you are. Yeah, and the key is to be yourself, so give them that cloth. You know what I mean? Yeah, facts, facts. So you know how the business works. Yeah. It's about you know, who you know and who knows you. And now at this point, I feel like you're in front of Khaled one-on-one. Can't thank y'all enough, man. It's crazy. You know, one thing that, that really caught to me is that he did mention that, you know, back in the days they didn't want him to do it. And, and that's the major key, you know right. what I mean? So work hard, man. Anything's possible, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. You already know. Definitely. 